We had calving glaciers coming off of the roof today. Big piles. There's a big one over there too. Good thing nobody was under there. That might have been moderately painful. Well, I'm going to try an expansion of an experiment that I started a few months back. The old stick on the tripod. We've got the stick on it, so we have a level base there to work with. And I marked out some holes to pre-drill so I can attach this backer board to the stick. Attach some of this hook and loop material to the backer board, which will sit on the stick, which will loop around and hold the iPad in place. Then we'll have it on a tripod and imagine the possibilities. Holes. Not just holes. Countersunk holes. Yippee. what we're going for. Stick on a tripod, it might worky. Looks pretty good, huh? So there we go. Stick on a tripod. iPad on a stick. So we got our saddle created, our little L bracket. And then we stapled some hook and loop material around through there, which goes in behind the iPad quite nicely. Keeps it secure. So now we have, we can move it around, up and down. Now that I got more portability, I can move around now, securely. Hopefully that will give us the opportunity to have some more flexibility and when we go to put the heater core in that pickup truck, we can position this in such a way as to take a nice steady camera angle as to what's going on. So, stick on a tripod 2.0. Well, this seems like a pretty decent sweet spot. Got the... Uh, Nice, I love me wall going on over here with the placards. Got the toolbox over here. The old farm sign. A cozy corner with pretty decent lights, I think, without too much glaring. Shine over here. Maybe we can put a shade on that light. Oh, I know. Mm. Oh, that's pretty good. Huh? Not bad for... Redneck in the middle of Kentucky, huh? Hello? Huh? Oh.
So what's that looking sound like? Of course, I'm looking over here, and I should be looking over here. Kind of nice to know where the camera's at. Don't you think? Well, it's time to close it up for the night. Night-night.